There's something spiritual about gathering around a table with family and friends, sharing stories and experiences, laughter and joy. It's a place where busyness ends. It is here, at this four-legged flat surface, that God's presence is ever so clear, a time when his creation can draw near, when fellowship is sincere, and all other distractions disappear. It gives us a chance in our fast-paced, technology-induced lives to revive the art of taking time, to slow down and have a meal with those who we might not otherwise. Because food is more than just a source of fuel. It's an area where God wants us to delight. With over 10,000 taste buds, eating goes further than just our appetite. It is a time when we can gather and come together as one, building new relationships. The table is open for everyone because the table is where broken sinners find connection and belonging through talking and walking through our struggles. We're strengthening the bonding of the church and its calling to reflect the image of Christ. You see, the table mattered to Jesus because it was at the table that he foretold the nature of his death. He didn't give them a sermon. Instead, they sat down and broke bread. And it was through that meal that he was led to give one of the most compelling lessons that he ever said. He met them where they were and he delivered it face to face, adding another layer to his all redeeming grace, wanting to connect and look into their eyes as he described the importance of carrying out his teaching when they were left behind. Food can be such a powerful way of growing in community. We should truly know the people in our pews and seats, not just look at the back of their heads as we listen to the pastor preach. The church shouldn't be contained to one location for one hour a week. It should be sustained through relationships. So let's meet and eat and speak with one another. Because the only way that the church can grow is if its people know that they have a home. Because if you feel connected, then you will be invested. So go and test it. Have a meal with someone new and let God's glory be manifested. Hey y'all, thanks for watching The Table Spoken Word. If you liked it, then check out some of our other videos. Also, feel free to follow me on Twitter and Instagram to stay current on some of our upcoming projects.